Congratulations, makers. Let's bring in our judges. Please tell us that we remember to invite the judges. Okay. Oh, good. Okay, here they are. Simon Doonan and Dana Isom Johnson. On Etsy, there are thousands of invitations for all these milestone parties. We need to understand who's this party for, what's the theme, knock my socks off with these 3D party invitations. Let's take a look. All right. Justine. This is my invitation to my dad's pre-retirement party. How cool. Joe Paul's rockin' pre-retirement party, RSVP, for a rockin' time. <laughs> <laughs> nice! As I was making it, I was kind of thinking if you do get it in the mail, you could then use it as a record storage system. I love that this is functional, in addition to being an invitation, that people can keep this and it has more than one use. I like that you took the 3D mandate and you kind of went nuts with it and gave did something very 3D. The calligraphy looks great. So many cool details on the buttons. Craftsmanship's on point, girl. Yeah. It's good. Thank you. Jesse. My party is called Souls on Fire, and it's kind of celebrating two of my best friends. Bring yourself and your dreams to help celebrate Hunter and Grant's journeys from small towns to the big city to follow their greatest passion. So the box is supposed to sort of represent like a matchbox. It feels like a super glamorous invite to like an Art Basel party. Yeah. This is great. Lily. So my daughter likes to sleep with us because <laughs> she's afraid to sleep in her own bed. So we want to do a, a big girl room for her. Ooh, so many layers. And I thought, how cool would it be to do a sleepover to ease the transition? Oh! oh how cute. I think my favorite part of this is the details that you did around the top. And then also just the small things like the untuck for people to really get involved with the invitation. It's very sweet. That could be a home for a doll. Oh my gosh, multifunctional again. What if she puts her doll in there and then she just comes back to your bed? <laughs> <laughs> no! So, judges, which invitations gave you a plus one and which made you want to send your regrets? Thank you guys for doing such an amazing interpretation of this challenge. The winner of this last foster craft is... Justine. Justine, you really took it up a notch with this 3D invite that is multifunctional that all of the invitees want to keep in their house. Congratulations. Rock and roll, Justine. Oh, you got to go up there. <laughs> <laughs> Congratulations. I'm super excited to win the patch. I'm really excited to throw this party. <laughs> Going into the Mastercraft, I'm feeling nervous and excited. It's anybody's game because I could never execute what Jesse could execute. I could never do what Lily does with phone court. It's like we're all superheroes with different powers competing. So I'm trying to like keep a level head and just put my best foot forward.